Welcome to Navigating the Healthcare Maze. You're watching part four of this five-part series. In these videos, you will learn about the different types of insurance coverage, where to receive care, and how to understand your medical bills so that you can take control of your health. One of the most confusing parts of healthcare are the bills and statements that you receive. This video will break each of them down and show you how to make better sense of them. If you go to an emergency room or are hospitalized, you may receive a facility bill, often called a hospital bill. This type of bill includes charges for services you received, such as surgery, physical therapy, laboratory services, or medications. You may also receive one or more professional bills, often called doctor's bills. These bills can come from different doctors, such as the emergency room doctor, surgeon, or anesthesiologist. Even if you don't see a specific doctor in person, like a radiologist, they are instrumental in contributing to your care. A professional bill may also come from doctors you see outside the hospital, such as your primary care doctor or specialist. Both types of bills contain similar information. Here's an example of a facility bill. Date of service is the actual date you received your care. Total charges show the full price of the services you received. The insurance payment line indicates the payment your insurance company has already made, so you're not responsible for paying that amount. You'll want to pay attention to the amount you owe line. This is the amount you are responsible for paying. In addition, you may receive an Explanation of Benefits, or an EOB. An EOB is a statement from your insurance company that summarizes the care you received and the amount you may owe. Most contain the date and description of service, total charges, allowed charges or the negotiated rate between the health plan and the provider, discount or adjusted amount, which is the difference between the total charges and the allowed charges, copay, the fixed amount you pay per visit, deductible, the amount you must pay before your insurance starts to pay, coinsurance, the percentage of charges you owe after your deductible is met, the amount paid by the insurer or health plan, and the patient responsibility or the amount you may owe. You should always compare any bills you've received to the EOB before making payments to ensure you only pay what you're responsible for. If you have any concerns or questions, call your insurance company, doctor's office, or hospital to clarify. To view the rest of the videos in the five-part series and to discover additional resources and tools, visit pihhealth.org forward slash resources. Be sure to like this video if you found it helpful and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter at PIH Health.